that's one time where it's absolutely 100% okay to hook up your gauges because you know that coming back on callbacks, coming back on service calls, that is not the time to be hooking up your gauges and dialing in charge. That's your time to be there troubleshooting. So when you have that opportunity after install on startup to dial in that charge as close as possible, don't be rushing to get out of there and leave your sub cool out of whack or your VSAT's where it needs to be. Do these and things on startup. We have a whole non-evasive charging procedure in Measure Quick that- Yes, that's um, what I wanted to get to next. All you got to do is profile the system. So you tell us what kind of metering device you have and whether it's fixed or TXV or EEV, what your condenser is approximately, what your target airflow is, if you have an oversized evaporator coil and then the software just does the calculations for you and figures out if you're in the right range or not you do need to do some things ahead of time again you want to have a clean condenser and a dry condenser you want to have a clean filter the system's got to stabilize you need to give it time for the algorithm and measure quick to determine it's stable yep. but once you're through that point you're pretty well good to go 